of the best things about living in Oregon is our beautiful outdoors. We have tide pools to play in, we have mountains to climb, and we have rivers to swim. And all of these natural wonders gives us information about earthquakes and tsunamis in our state. What is an earthquake and what is a tsunami? In this video, we will learn about earthquakes and tsunamis, knowing what to do before, during, and after an earthquake or tsunami is the best way to stay safe. Earthquakes. So what is an earthquake? Well, the surface of the earth is made of very big rocks called plates. These plates fit together like a puzzle. They are deep in the ground and always moving. The plates push and push and push against each other. This makes pressure. When there's a lot of pressure, the plates can break and suddenly move. This sudden movement makes the ground shake, and this shaking is called an earthquake. Tsunamis. Now what is a tsunami? A tsunami is a very large wave or group of waves that can be caused by an earthquake. The first tsunami wave is not always the largest wave or the only wave. Tsunami waves can last for hours. These waves can travel faster than a person can run and are very dangerous. Did you know that a tsunami wave can travel up to 500 miles an hour? That's as fast as a jet plane. Safety. In Oregon, earthquake safety is important. It's as simple as drop, cover, and hold on. When you're inside and the ground begins to shake, drop. drop. This means you drop to the ground and get on your hands and knees. Cover. cover. Get underneath your desk or a sturdy table and cover your head with one hand. Hold, Hold on. on! Hold on to the table or desk with your other hand. Here's how you do it. Earthquake! Good job, you guys. If you are not near a table or desk, move away from windows or tall objects. Then drop, drop. to the ground and cover. cover your head with both hands. Like this. That's how you do it. If you are outside, move away from buildings and overhead objects. Then drop, drop. to the ground and cover. cover your head with both hands. Just like this. <laughs> nice job. After the shaking stops, follow directions from teachers or adults about what to do and where to go. If you are by the water, run uphill to go to higher ground because a tsunami could be on its way. Now that you have learned earthquake and tsunami safety at school, practice these actions at home. Let's all be earthquake and tsunami ready together.